You can't guarantee me anything. Mitch will not get near you. So you're gonna watch me 24-7? You are going to have me or Oliver Fish here every hour until the baby is born. Oliver Fish? Kyle, what's up? Okay, now you know you can't ever tell anyone. Something came up during rounds today. What happened? I can't tell you. Uh, I, w I wish I could, but I can't. What is it? Some big secret? It falls under doctor-patient confidentiality. But you're not even a doctor yet. I know. It still applies to anything a patient tells me. I'm sorry. Hey, it's okay. You know, there's going to be police work that I can't discuss with you either. Is there anything I can do to help? I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Nobody wants a doctor who blabs. I'm glad you follow the rules. <laughs> I'd trust you. <laughs> Whoa! You need hosing off. What How could you do that to Rex? You know, I am starving. Right, let's order in. Actually, I have a major craving for a veggie panini from Positano. I'll call. But they don't deliver. Please. I'll pick it up. While you're out, you think you could get me some cheese fries and maybe some churros and maybe a piece of Noel's key lime pie from Buenos Aires? Why not? Thank you. You run a linebacker in there? A dancer. They burn up a lot of calories. I'm going to call Fish, see if he can come over while I'm gone. Ugh. Oh, I wish I could forget the day I had. Oh, yeah? What'd you have in mind? Hmm. One, one sec. No, go ahead. Fish. Hey, it's Rex. Can you come over for an hour or so? Uh, I just got off. I will double your rate for the trouble. Yeah, yeah, okay, I'll, I'll be right there. I, um... I heard. I'm sorry, but, you know, it's, it's extra cash, and it's keeping Rex's baby safe. It's kind of it's hard to say no. I need to grab a shower. Do not open the door to anyone. Okay. executive assistant. And you're Stacy's friend. Yes, the stripper. You off to a new gig? What's holding up our evening here? Hey, Natalie. Dad. Jesse, what a Dad. surprise. Hi. Sorry to interrupt. No, no, you're not interrupting. Uh, Kim and I were just about to sit down and have dinner. And we have got plenty of food. Do you want to join us? Excuse me. Kimmy, this whole thing is coming down around my ears. I need you, like, right now. Perfect, I'm on my way. I'm so sorry, but I have to run. Why? Stacy's having a meltdown, but I'll come back as soon as I can. Well, don't rush on our account. I really hope you're still here. You, wait up for me. I will. Well, let's get in there. Let's eat. Wait up for me? <laughs> Very in the sun. Yeah. It's... I can't even talk about it. Anybody would want a drink after that. Well, I mean, he, he slipped apparently after Jared's funeral. But then he told me he wasn't going to drink anymore. You know, so we were here, and Jessica and Natalie were with us, and... And Mitch Lawrence shows up. He's, he's out. He's free, you know. Oh, yeah, we heard. And what that did to Charlie? And there's absolutely nothing I can say to him to make it better. So he left, and I wanted to go with him. He said, no, he wanted to be alone. And I, you know, I, I can't follow him after that. No, of course you couldn't. Charlie has to do this for himself. I oh, know. The only person who can stop Charlie from drinking is Charlie. Double vodka. <laughs> Are you sure you want to do that? <laughs>